Hello year six, I hope you are fine. I'm happy to see you again and let's start our art lesson. Today we are going to talk about silhouettes. Can I draw silhouettes from under the sea? Materials required. Paper, water cups, paints, brushes, pencil, rubber, a permanent marker or black pencil. First of all, let's look in the dictionary and give some definitions for these words. Foreground, background, silhouette, diagonal line, outline. Foreground, the part of the view that is nearest to the observer, especially in the picture or photograph. Background, the part of the picture, scene or design that forms a setting for the main figures or objects or appears furthest from the viewer. Silhouette. A silhouette is the image of a person, animal, object or scene represented as a solid shape of the single color, usually black, with its edges matching the outline of the subject. The interior of the silhouette is featureless and the silhouette is usually presented on the light background. Diagonal line. Any sloping line is called diagonal. Outline. A line or set of lines enclosing or indicating the shape of an object in the sketch or diagram. Look at the picture and say, is the turtle or seaweed closer in the picture? Yes, you are right. The seaweed is closer in the picture and the turtle is further. What can you say about the background? The background is unusual. It seems like you are laying uh, in the bottom of the sea on your back and looking forward. The sunrise give you only a silhouette of the turtle and different plants. How to create it? We are going to use blue and white paint to depict water and sun rays. When it's dry, we will use black paint to depict um, marine animals and different plants. Here you can find some ideas for your pictures. You can challenge yourself and use the same technique to add more complicated shapes as a sea urchin or jellyfish. This is my set. Step number one. Paint the background first and let it dry. As you can see, I use blue paint and I leave the uh, sun circle at the top. I left it white. I paint it with diagonal lines. When it's dry, you can use white paint to depict sun rays. Start to paint it from the middle of the uh, sun circle. Step number two. While the paint is drying, you can begin sketching ideas for the foreground as a turtle or plants. Step number three. On the top of the background, you can pencil in the silhouette image. Another option is cutting out the design uh, on another paper and to trace it onto the background. Then trace in black permanent marker for the script edge and paint the foreground shape in black. As you can see here, I started um, from the black paint directly. You can turn around your paintings if it is more comfortable to draw different plants. And this is my final picture. Please answer the questions. What have you drawn? Do you have, do you know any types of marine animals? plants that have that have already disappeared please write your answers to on the paper and send it to my gmail or send it to your teachers and now i would like to show you 
my under the sea picture with silhouettes. I hope you enjoyed staying with me, waiting for more pics from you of your drawings. See you next time. Bye bye.